Today my boyfriend's gonna be giving me the names of famous logos and I'm gonna try to draw them from memory. I will take this as a win. I don't know if it's a win. That's exactly right! If you're new here, I'm Tyler, AKA Tylee Talk, and on this channel I design, redesign, and critique logos. So if that's something you're into, then go ahead and give me subscribe. So I get a lot of comments when I make these videos on what kind of program and software I'm using. So I am using my iPad Pro uh, with Procreate and the Apple Pencil. So let's get started. All right, Travis, you ready? Uh huh. Okay. This one. I would get wrong. Okay. But I feel like you should get right. Okay. Bet. You just love giving me a little, <laughs> little men to draw. <laughs> you know the little, um, little levitating man emoji? No. With the hat on, it kind of looks like Michael Jackson. What? <laughs> I'm pretty sure it looks kind of like that. <laughs> okay, it has like a really big... Am I even alive? What are you talking about? <laughs> Is it levitating? Yeah. Or like he's like- standing. It literally has a shadow underneath it as part of the emoji. He's levitating. Like Vecna? Yeah, exactly like that. What? Where <laughs> is this? I've never seen this. I'm thinking the font is kind of like old timey maybe. Okay, I'm done. Okay. It's cartoony. Oh, he's very like proper. Yeah. <laughs> and he's got a yellow shirt on. He's got like little knees. Oh okay. yeah. <laughs> He kind of looks like the levitating man. He doesn't look like the levitating man. I mean, I was pretty close on a lot of things. Yeah, I mean, you have the gist. The he's gist. holding the pen behind him as if he's like hiding it. He's like, we'll do something very calm and very easy. We'll do bit, don't do that. We'll do something very calm and easy. <laughs> Pepsi. Okay, why am I blanking on which one's on the top? <laughs> okay, I mean, it's blue, white, and red, but I really don't remember which one's on the top. I think I'm gonna go with, blue on the bottom. All right, so I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna make this be a alpha lock layer and we're gonna get our blue. It used to be perfectly straight across the middle but now it does like a weird one-sided kind of thing. I feel like the white line kind of goes from one side thinner and one side not as thin. Oh, that looks right. Let me see. Yeah, that's pretty much exact spot on. Maybe just a little more like Whoopity. Um, I picked copper tone. Although, does this have like a little girl's butt <laughs> hanging out? <laughs> okay, well, I don't know that I need to draw that. Next. Delta. Why am I blanking on this? I mean, it's a triangle and it's blue and red. However, what else does it look like? I feel like it's kind of like two tones of blue maybe. Okay, and now <laughs> where does the red come in? I don't know if she has words on it or not. I think I'm done. Are you ready? Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Choices have been made. <laughs> I got the two-tone right. It's just not blue. I just couldn't figure out where the red is. And little did I know the whole triangle is red. What did you know about that comfort plus? So it's gonna be hard. Okay, oh no. Red bull. Okay, I mean, I know that it's blue and red and yellow, I think. Is it? Yeah. I'm pretty sure that the ye the yellow is a circle and there's like red bull, but I think there's two red bulls. Uh, now, can I draw a bull from memory? <laughs> That's the question. I think they're like facing each other. Do you think these cows have horns? Is it called red cow or red bull? But not all bulls have horns. Uh. Don't do that, <laughs> camera. I feel like on the can, the cans are blue, but I don't know if the actual logo has blue on it. And we're gonna call that done. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it's very wrong. Clearly low effort, uh, not, not photorealism, wow. It's not photorealistic, it's a drawing. So there is no blue. I mean, you got the, the cows facing each other right. All right, I am not the kind of artist that can just whip up a photorealistic cow without looking at a reference. <laughs> but I will take this as a win. I don't know if it's a win. Um, PBS. Do you know what the S stands for? Public Broadcast System? Uh -huh. I worked for Kentucky's PBS station, if you recall. Wow. K-E-T. Okay, they're very blocky letters, I know that. And the P is a face, like it has a little nose and a little eye. Now we're gonna see if 
That's what my memory's telling me. <laughs> Your face is telling me it's not. <laughs> it's actually kind of hard to draw letters like really smoothly on here. Okay, I, in my memory. I can guarantee you it's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> That's so rude. <laughs> I, I can't make this look like the face that it looks like in my head. <laughs> wow. That is a face. Yeah, duh. You just, we were like, I said there's a face and you were like, well, I think your memory was wrong. <laughs> no, you said the P is a face and I said, mm. That's a P. No. A backwards this is a P. P. That's a backwards P. P, B, S, and then there's a circle with faces in it. But I think the, I think that's supposed to be a backwards P. Why would they have a backwards P? It's, <laughs> it's multiple faces for the public. It's the public. Now that, now that I've seen it, this is what it is in my mind. So it's a P. Oh, you couldn't draw it before. I was like blinking on where the nose went. In my mind, I was combining their actual logo with the, the P in PBS. Like basically that. It looks like a scary man. <laughs> <laughs> no, it doesn't. It looks like the Twitter bird face, but like with a double chin. This is one of my favorite ones. Okay. And it's in our household. So I hope you would know. Tide. Okay, orange box. <laughs> Let's start there. Yellow and blue and white. It's like a target. If it's like alternating yellow and blue circles or yellow and white circles, and then tied is, I'm just gonna play around a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna call it. Call it. <gasps> That's exactly right. Yeah. Well, there's one, I added one extra circle. All right, that one is a win. That is a win. Okay, what's next? Old Spice. Well, I know it's red. Ooh, it has a little sailboat. I feel like it has, all oh, these are red, white, and blue. <laughs> Does it not have blue? Never mind, it's not red, white, and blue. I don't know why I'm choosing this font, but I am. Okay, is it a sailboat or a pirate ship? The age old question. Tomato, tomato. You know, I kind of like that logo, but it is, well, it's very wrong. Oh, it is a pirate ship. <laughs> <It is. laughs> Just a little tiny dingy. This is like Sperry's logo. Yeah, this is like an. This is like very formal. And yeah. It's like an app. Old Spice Junior. <laughs> the font. I was kind of right to do the curly font though. Like yeah. very like loose. I got Snapchat. Okay, I like this. He used to have a face, but not anymore. I think Snapchat is the most purposeful name out of all the modern like social media apps. Snapchat makes sense because you're snapping photos and you're chatting about it. And it's a ghost because they go away. <gasps> See? It's the most comprehensive. Da -da -da -da! It kind of looks like a little marshmallow. Mine looks like Casper. Yeah, this one's more like a dress. A dress? <laughs> that one's like a sheet ghost. Right, right, right. Which I don't know what other that one looks like a person with a sheet over it. Yeah. Whereas a ghost is not a sheet. They're not real, so they can be whatever you want them to be. Controversial take. <laughs> GE. Okay, it's like a purpley red, and it's a perfect circle. Wait, I'm thinking of LG. <laughs> you were like, it is not red. All right, GE is blue. I think it has a cursive G and an E in it. However, I don't know how to draw a capital cursive G. Do I? Okay, we're going with that. What is it the boomers always say? <laughs> can't, can't draw cursive. Well, but guess what, bitch? I don't have to. <laughs> yeah, something like that. I don't even have to write anymore. <laughs> okay, I'm done. <laughs> okay, it's a little more fancy. But I mean, you have to write. I mean, actually, I kind of like that one. Mine's more electric. Truly. All right, let's do one more. Dominoes. It used to be like a box, but now it's just one domino. I think the top is blue and the bottom is red. I know one is one and one is two. This looks right. Okay, I'm done. Okay. Why did I think it was all lowercase? I don't know. Was it in the right order? The dots and the colors? No, no why do I always do that? Well, I think that's quite enough for the day. I think I could have done better on most of them. <laughs> 
However, I'm happy that I got some of them right. Let's see which ones I think I did the best on. Okay, Tide, I'm really impressed with myself on. And the Bic, the little Bic guy looks really cute to me, even though he's a little uh, lacking detail. And I like my interpretation of Old Spice, even though it was fully wrong. <laughs> I really dropped the ball on PBS and Delta. <laughs> Delta especially. Okay. <laughs> well, that's it for today. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like, share it with your friends, and subscribe to the channel. And definitely put down in the comments which logos you want Travis to give me next time. Mm -hmm.